Ottawa County health officials say they're seeing more ticks this year than ever before, and they're causing real problems for both people and pests alike. 24 Hour News 8's Justin Kolar shows us how you can avoid these eight-legged parasites and how the county is taking action against them. Areas off the beaten path filled with dead leaves, tall grasses and brush should be avoided if you want to stay tick free this summer. Officials here in Ottawa County say this year there's more ticks than they've ever seen. We seem to be seeing more ticks every year than we did the year before. And it's pretty amazing because 20 years ago, I don't remember seeing any ticks around here. And the Ottawa County Department of Public Health wants to know why. We just now started being able to collect ticks uh, for this season and that was provided by a grant from the state. These are American dog ticks. They don't carry Lyme disease. Thanks to a new state grant, the Ottawa County Department of Public Health is able to go out and collect these arachnids to help determine which kind and how many are living in the area. What we do is we take a linen and drag it through a heavily tick area. Uh, such as through the leaf litter or the tall grasses. And then we actually count and identify uh, to see the number of black leg ticks that we may have in a certain area. The black leg tick, infamous for carrying Lyme disease, a disease Dr. Eric Heitman explains doesn't discriminate. Well, we always talk to clients about screening their dogs and themselves after they've been out in the woods because the tick will grab onto anything that moves by them. And while you may not be able to always spot a tick, there are ways of preventing them from seeing and latching on to you. When you're outside, be sure to also wear 20 to 30 percent DEET. When leaving the outdoors after a walk or hike, be sure to give yourself a thorough check for any ticks that may have come your way. Dark, warm places like your armpits can be some of ticks' favorite hiding places. For more information, check out our website at woodtv.com. In Ottawa County, Justin Kolar, 24-Hour News 8.